some time ago, I said, the next thing they're going to do is claim, think of the children. I was right. Called it. Told you so. Neener, neener, you're a fucking idiot. You didn't listen. There we go. All the obligatory, I'm better than you. I fucking knew it was going to happen, bullshit. Oh, and by the way, this bullshit that's going on, that YouTube and the FTC and, uh, what's that company that, uh, bitch face uh, a jit pie motherfucker was with yeah you think that that's gone and over with no that motherfucking packy piece of shit started all of this or rather he was step three in rick rolling everyone across youtube entirely with this and if you just trace the paperwork trail you, you'll get to the source. Most notoriously, it's everyone's complacency. Oh, let the government take care of us. Let the government dictate what we can and can't do. Well, sure, we'll surrender our freedoms because we're afraid of things you say are bad. Fuck every last goddamn one of you. You're all a bunch of fucking mindless sheeple. Fucking pathetic. What's going to happen next? Well, it's already happening. The bureaucratization and corporatization of life as you fucking know it. See, um... Late night shows that move to YouTube. Uh... All the big YouTubers that have stopped doing a lot of gaming content and have started uh, appearing on those uh, late night shows and news channels like Mark and Jack. They're going to stay there. Oh, albeit they may not earn any money at all anymore, but they're going to stay there. Because they've got a fucking contract now. Freelance YouTubers who do this shit just because they enjoy it. They're going to slowly be whittled away one by one. It's the old boiling a frog alive trick. But then, and it's already happening to be honest. And they're going to slowly whittle them away even more until there's no one left but the uh, the companies. Companies who are owned by parent companies and umbrella corporations like uh, Verizon and Comcast and Charter. All the fuckers who have uh, ruined the site by attacking YouTubers like the Wall Street Journal did to Pewds. That's when all this bullshit started. I've just been sitting here watching, wondering who the fuck's gonna catch on? Who's gonna notice that uh, they're essentially being thrown into a pot of uh, frogs and being boiled alive very slowly? I've watched as they've encroached on video gaming. They're trying to make it illegal. The only way they know how to fuck people over is to use all the mindless sheeple who are afraid of something and use terrorism to control them in the way that they want. That's their plan. Just slowly whittle away until there's no original content creators left. Until everything is owned by the corporation for the corporation. So, here's a possibility. Why don't a bunch of you fucking idiots band together and make a competitor site with YouTube with absolutely no fucking advertisements? Don't 
don't you think that would be a viable option at this point? To abandon the sinking ship? To get the fuck out while you can? And try and make something that's better? Well, if any of you want to run with that idea, good fucking luck with it. Because the FTC and, uh, uh, what was that other bullshit with the jit pie? That they'll definitely come after you, too. <clears throat> it takes a lot to run worldwide servers. And why the fuck should I help you set it all up? Even though I've been sitting here watching this catastrophe and thinking of ideas to fix various problems and counter other various problems before they arrive. Why the fuck should I help you? Point in case. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen years ago, was it? I don't fucking remember. But it was more than fifteen at this point. I tried to help uh, Microsoft get out of uh, some bullshit situation before it started. I even wrote the fuckers letters. I copied the letter and sent it in once a week for three months. They didn't give a fuck. Now look at this bullshit that's going on. They let bureaucratization and corporatization get into them. And now video games are absolute fucking shit these days. Am I going to tell you what I wrote them? Fuck no. None of you deserve to know what I've been trying to do for over 15 fucking years to help all of you. Fuck all of you. I want to watch the world burn now. I'm sick of trying to help everyone. No one gives a shit. <clears throat> I'm sick of telling everyone, hey, that's wrong. It's going to lead to shit down the line. And watching it happen because they don't want to listen. They think they know every goddamn thing. I'm sick of it. Now I just want to watch the world burn. Spoilers, it's scheduled to start next year. <laughs>